Hello everyone, welcome back to Ninja where we make the videos no one else wants. So, My Hero Academia and Ninjago, right? Both series had major plot points leak way before their official release, including a final chapter and half of an entire season. But don't worry folks, I won't give any spoilers here. Just thinking about these two universes makes me envision an epic fight worth of calculating for a future video, Lloyd vs. Deku. But if we could consider something else, Kai vs. Baku. A few spots down the list is what we're doing later, it's Neo vs. Rock. But today we will be talking with everybody's favorite lightning fast quick mouths, Jay and Deki. But how would they hold against each other in a fight? Well, we found out. To explain how, we just needed a few special numbers. We'll grade both fighters in three categories. Their attack power, how much electricity they can withstand, and the application of their abilities. Both fighters can generate immense amounts of electricity in their respective series. Kaminari has an ultimate attack where he can generate 1.3 million volts of electricity, while Jay can conduct 1.21 gigawatts of power. Just to clarify, volts aren't directly comparable to watts, like kilometers to miles. There's something else in the equation. Volts represent voltage, the force behind the electricity, and amps measure the current, or the amount of electricity flowing. Multiplying these two gives us watts, which represent power. The writing in both shows doesn't provide all the details we need to make precise calculations, but we'll cut the writers some slack and estimate the amps based on their effects. Because Kaminari's 1.3 million volts can incapacitate victims, we'll assume that it's around the 100-200 milliamp range at the lowest, but it could as well be a higher range, so I'll be generous and give him 200 milliamps. Plugging that into our calculators, we have 260,000 watts. So Kaminari's peak power is in the hundreds of thousands, while Jay already reaches billions. Besides a filler movie that ca allows Kaminari to use 2 million volts, which is still only equal to 500,000 watts, this represents both of them at their peak power, even though Jay never even has to use it. Therefore, we'll award this point to Jay. In Jaco Season 6, Episode 5, Jay withstands the force of full-on lightning bolts, which are about 300 million volts and about 30,000 amps. To put that into perspective, Jay is taking on about 6 million times as much as it would to fatally injure a person. Now let's examine Kaminari's durability. In My Hero Academia Season 6, Episode 3, he absorbs the full force of a thug in the Paranormal Liberation Arc. Since the unnamed thug doesn't specify how many volts he can generate, we'll estimate to be the, in the million range. We already know Kaminari is a cap on his own powers at 1.3 million volts, becomes disoriented and unable to do anything. The thug also mentions, How many millions of volts can you take before you reach your limit? Suggesting the attack was likely much lower than Jay's impressive feat of 300 million volts. Now, what about the joules, which measure the energy transferred through both fighters? Let's calculate. In 1.21 billion watts over one second, that should be about 1.21 billion joules. 1 million volts over 51 seconds of screen time should be about 51 million joules. So it's not even close. Point J. Finally, although it might not greatly impact a fight, we'll discuss the application of powers, how the characters exert their energy. Jay can generate common lightning bolts that he can usually stun his opponents and shock them, estimating about 50 milliamps of current based on his ability to shock and incapacitate foes. Kaminari is similar, capable of knocking out an average person with his lightning wrist shooter. However, he doesn't score a point in this category because we haven't even mentioned spin jitsu, air jitsu, or any of Jay's special techniques. So, I guess that just because you're in a shonen, you don't solo every other verse. And if you want to see more impossible feats, check out our video on DuckTales, Giga Death! For more calculations, don't miss our video on Earthbound. Too many burgers? 